I want you to raise your hand if you've seen an increase in violence in the last four years. Pews filled with residents of the original Highlands voiced their concerns over the recent violence in their neighborhood. I think everybody's fed up. Two people were killed and another was injured in what police are now confirming were two separate shootings on August 11th on Baxter Avenue. Richie Williams is accused of shooting and killing Monte Wade before witnesses say Williams ran from the scene and was shot and injured by an unknown person. In a separate shooting three minutes later, someone shot and killed Michael Batchelor. That person is not in custody. Highlands Council member Ben Reno Weber talked about the investigation. The concerns of community members are being heard and responded to by proactive work up and down all of our entertainment corridors in coordination of these agencies and others. And while the violence that took place here on Baxter Avenue two weekends ago is top of mind for many neighbors, they're also concerned about other things in their neighborhood. Original Highlands Association Board President Ralph Melbourne says over the last four years, more people are heading to the bars on Baxter Avenue but not more police officers. We live in a predominantly safe community with a corridor problem. Uh, I don't think that the corridor is being policed appropriately in terms of volume. I think the numbers are low based on the sheer amount of people coming in, mostly for the express purpose of consuming alcohol. Maggie Cassaro has lived in the original Highlands for 28 years. Yeah, I really would not want to live anywhere else in Louisville. And I love the original Highlands. It's a very quiet, peaceful, quaint community, except the bar scene. The violence isn't her only concern. Bars are really infringing on the rights of the neighbors. We don't want to put them out of business. We just want them to realize that parking is a huge issue. And along with that parking then becomes the myriad of other issues. For now, the focus is with LMPD and the Louisville Metro Alcoholic Beverage Control to find a solution. In the Highlands, Alex Dieterer, the WHAS 11 night team on your side.